all right hey guys welcome back to my channel this is going to be my week two check-in for the month of february so if you're new i use this monthly planner that i got from radon and it is um uh, it was like five bucks and it's a 17 month planner and i started it in august because i used to do this in my um Aaron condren but that was like my daily planner, not a financial planner. So I decided to get this one. And then I love the stickers, the organization. So I decided to keep it. And this is when I still had credit card debt. I still had credit card debt. So I organized my stickers by credit card, school loans, if I save money and if I tutor. So this one still had credit card debt. Um, credit card debt. And I would like write down if I use my credit card. And if I check it, I paid it off. If I didn't, then it wasn't paid off. Like, for example, like here, I didn't pay that off, didn't pay that off, didn't pay these off. Um, and then by November, I finished off my credit card debt. And then December, I still used my credit card, but I would pay it right off right away once it got in my statement so that I could get the points. So even though I'm credit card debt free now, I still use my credit cards because I, I like to get the rewards. So we are in February um, and we're going to do, oh no, we're doing week one, my bad, week one, um, second to the eighth. So I write down everything I do on a weekly basis and um yeah let's get started i use planner k stickers because they're more i would it's like more for your money um so like each one is worth five bucks or like 550 i think five bucks so yeah other like there's other cute stickers out there but this one is worth more for your money and then you don't have to keep repurchasing and paying shipping costs and all that and planner kate has like a deal where like if you spend 35 dollars, it's free shipping which i love and you get like little sampler stickers which is cute so yeah i've definitely stick to planner kate for my spending trackers all right um on february 2nd i bought groceries with my american express which is this one looks like i'm gonna have to buy another american express sticker tracker soon um but we'll see about that so i bought groceries groceries oh no something popped off pay bills so i bought groceries and that was 20 and i paid that off and that was on the second and then all right so i also did tutor and that was 20. that was sunday and i'm not checking it off because i haven't got paid for it so in total for tutoring now it is um 80. so tutor total tutor is 80 so I'm gonna put that right here because today's Saturday all right perfect um then on February 6 I had to give a gift in cash and I used gold for that so I'm gonna put gift is 10 sorry for the noise guys in the background um okay so the six was a gift in ten dollars then i did reload my starbucks card can i use this color yes so i'm put starbucks which i haven't reloaded in a long time and i paid that off um, let's see, the last time I bought Starbucks was the second week in January. 
so it's been a while because it was buy one get one free and like why not so that was 10 on the 6th and then I bought a cash envelope for four dollars and I used my American Express um, Etsy so I'm excited for that one to come in um, it's a new shop that I've never shopped before um, and I saw that they were giving cash envelopes they made cash envelopes and it was free shipping and I was like you know what let me just try it out and see if I like it because I, I want a wax package cash envelope since I am going to be adding that to my budget because it's just cheaper that way um, so I want an envelope for that um, and I paid that off already and then um that is it yeah so it was a really good week oh i like friday i went to the store because i didn't pack lunch and i spent 650 um i'll put lunch and i paid cash 650 and that was friday um yeah and then oh i think it was wednesday yeah wednesday i also spent ten dollars on groceries and that was cash i'm gonna put groceries my food expenses have been quite good because i've been making like not big bulk but like for example onion soup um and the green ingredients for that is like nothing you just need onions chicken broth garlic um and basically that's it and onions obviously i don't know if i said that but yeah i've been eating that and then i eat whatever's in my fridge like if i have eggs i finished my eggs that was 10. um oh i lied and then for here that was also cash i bought dinner and that was 10 in cash which is not that bad. So my grocery week money for the week is 10. So let's see how much I spent this week in food. All right, 20 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 650. So 56 and 50 cents. Oh, plus 10 because I did that my Starbucks came out from my food budget and then um to be honest it came my Etsy I put in my food budget too came out from my food budget so I basically have like five bucks left to my name this week and the week is over so that would just carry on to next week's food budget so instead of having 75 I will have 80 um so yeah um and then this was in cash so it's already paid off so yeah, now I am going to put in my no spend days. Um, let me do it like this. Hold on. I should have them easily. Here we go. Which one am I using the most right here? Okay. I just kind of want to finish that off first. Alright. So no spend on Monday and Tuesday. Monday, I had a no spend, Tuesday, I had a no spend, and then today, no spend. Um, I think I'm getting allergies, guys. Anyway, so this was, ooh, should I write down? No, let's not do that yet. Um, Alright, so this was my week one check-in for February from the 2nd to the 8th. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you... Oh, hold up. Hold up. Let me put this away. Because I'll be mad when I don't put it away. So, it goes right here in the little slot in the back. Alright, so um, I hopefully I see you in my next video. Bye!